I'm eating French toast. I have left over from this morning, but it's still so good. So, I got the second round of notes from my editor. First round of notes was like eight pages. This round of notes, two pages. I count that as a success. In other news, I was dressed up nice. I was going to go see a movie with my dad, and I walk out, and I have a flat tire. Oh, crap. So, call my dad. He's like, you know how to, you know how to train shit. I'm like, well, yeah, I guess I do. You did show me, like, ten years ago. I haven't done it since, but I can try. <laughs> and, like, I would have done it. I would have put the donut tire on my car, but I couldn't get the cap off the spare. And that thing was rusted in place, so I couldn't, I could do one rotation, and then it got stuck. But if I had gotten that, I'm confident that I could have jacked up the car and replaced the tire to get it to a Les Schwab. As it is, I just pumped up the tire instead, and I took it over, and there was a hole in it, so they had to replace it, which was, huh, huh, huh. But it's not a new car, so. I need to have French toast for the afternoon, always, now, for some amazing. I am also trying to learn the ways of the Tumblr. I have never been on Tumblr before, and I was urged to create a Tumblr. And I'm still confused by it. I'm not that hip, besides my hair. So if you need advice on what to do with this tumbler, please tell me, because I'm kind of clueless about it. You'll be pleased to note that since I am a, a, a romance novelist now, I guess, I think I can, I can say that. But as a romance writer, it's nice if you have romance in your own life, which I haven't for a long time now, which was fine. But there is a certain gentleman who has caught my attention, and I quite like him. All I can say is that my friend is far superior to any character I could write. And that should tell you something, because I write some pretty kick-ass characters. And that's all I'm going to say. So, <clears throat> yes, uh, in other news, I have to finish revisions by September 1st. After September 1st, I'm going to start outlining the sequel. Because there's going to be at least one more book in this world. Stuff happens, and it's more like, oh, this is the stuff behind the stuff that's been happening. I don't have a name for it yet. I have a, I have a crappy tentative title, but it's, it's, it's also extremely hot right now. It's very toasty. Mmm. Oh, oh. Ah, it's a mango margarita. Can you see, can you see the hair color? It turned out really cool this time. As far as I'm aware, I'm her only client that does stuff like this. This is the latest color. How cool is that? It's like navy blue. Oh my gosh, last note, last, I promise, last note. Guardians of the Galaxy comes out soon. I just found out that um, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy 2 is confirmed for 2017. I haven't even seen the first one yet and I'm already excited about the sequel because the trailer is fantastic. And when the trailer is that fantastic, the movie must therefore be at least half that fantastic. I'm going to be happy. All the cover art that's been revealed for Avengers Age of Ultron, Although I saw Lucy, I saw Lucy, I saw Lucy, and I wanted to like it so badly, and I didn't. It was trying really hard to be really serious about philosophy and, 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 and metaphysics and, and life and humanity and what makes you human. And, and it was just cool action, really good, like, you know, effects and stuff. I like Scarlett Johansson and Morgan Freeman, but still looking forward to Guardians of the Galaxy. Chris Pratt, oh, you have my heart. Okay, that was seriously it. And um, <clears throat> I'm going to get back to work.